Hey everyone, it's me, Brian with Destructive Media, back with another reaction video for you all today. Today I'm going to be reacting to another BTS song, or songs. Um, I'm finally reacting to the BTS ciphers. I'm going to be reacting to part one through part four. Um, unlike what I usually do on the channel, um, I'm not going to go over the lyrics on Dual Set today after each song. Um, after each song, I'm just going to give a couple thoughts on the song I just heard. Then we're going to move on to the next song. Um, so not much more to say. Um, I've been looking forward to this for a very, very long time. Um, I've been kind of waiting to get more background on BTS and all the stuff that's happened to them before I listen to the ciphers. Um, as many of you know, you got to kind of know a little bit about their background and how they started and all that stuff before you really understand what's going on in the ciphers. So with that out of the way, we're going to flip on over to my other screen here. We are going to finally listen to the ciphers together. All right, well, I got the video pulled up here. Like I always say, if you can, pop on a pair of headphones. Music always sounds better with headphones on. Uh, but yeah, let's listen to the ciphers together. Oh man, I cannot wait. Back a little bit. Damn hip boost, I don't rap or cut that boost. Chop your bones and I don't see shit. I'm your nine moose shit. Shoot that down when it gets going to hit him a pew. Team will touch my moose. He bought them more than a need to How you kill me? So bring the monster bag and distract my monster swag. So this is the monster track. It's my freaking monster rap. Him that pan hong the jungle, jungle, poke the top of my test. I'm said the leader, so I'm a leader. Egon said that yo, Jam say. Yeah, I'm the top of the top of the top. Still be. All right, so right again, or right off the bat here, we're starting with. uh Everybody calling him just an idol rapper. He's just an idol. He doesn't know how to rap. Um, you know, he's not a real rapper, um, which is ridiculous. We all know Kim Nam Joon is one of the best lyricists out there. Um, you know, like, I don't know. It just, it bothers me as it bothers a lot of you. And just because he joined an idol group or helped form BTS and, um, and BTS wasn't even formed the same way as the K-pop group. Anyway, we all know. Um, people just assumed. They just they don't listen without judgment. And they don't like it because of that. So this is the monster track. It's my freaking monster rap. Hyundai Pan Hong, the jungle, jungle. Poco to Chotaba Motes. I'm said the leader, so I'm a leader. Egon said that yo, Jam say. Yeah, I'm the top of the top of the top. Still be popping and rocking. I'm stopping and blocking. I'm like the Casio signs on my gun. Be choosing my because I'm not freaking darn. We have some gobbles in my cause every kick is my freaking son. Nah, wallet grind there. But now I'm a Marty, you rappers. Try to dead or sort of body, but then I'm a Marty. You hate it. Try to now walk. Look at my other one. No guy, he's top five. Rap monster, rhyme, die. Lead the ram on the Appa. Suck yo. Appa. Suck yo. Give me a whole word from BTS. Some gonna follow. They got a song of late tweet. Bad mo they get all your net flow. Come back and talk on me. Moment chair. What kind of got us on the ill we check it back in the day. Snigel, Nigel, Rhyme, the more like the Nigel. Cause I go bad up on Grand Tue. And I know you're still not great. And boy, you're too gay. Trick beside for it. So they pull it back. I'm more both the minors. Hmm. Cause no one knows that a major. Uh. And TV screen and a chair. What? Uh. Rap a custom. No. Kaboom, we go. Wipe away the foam and spit it out because he's got rabies. <laughs> so good. But now I'm that a major, uh. And TV screen and a chair, what, uh. Rap a custom, no. Couple more go, go. The better, they got one hat, don't go so. And dig a muddy guy to wish you gam. They got a plume and bell on guys on tea to gam. The pebble and body don't side under the dream more. We're top to hit pushing punch in the game. We take hope and punch it. Now I'm a pill, but to me, and jug of shit. We are full of proof, but I'm dying and not get sick. Also, I'm going to get a little chill. 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 I'm going to a uh, composer, one of the greatest of all time. Thing is, his beats are in 4K. They're so clear. <laughs> sugar, I'm old sugar, angry sugar. It's, oh, it's gonna be so good. Um, I, I, my hair is already standing up on end. I, yeah, 
Memento, he'll forget it. Oh, Oh my god. Um, I go back to my screen here and give a couple thoughts while I pull up part two. Um, Sugar went super hard there. Um, I loved every part of his verse. Uh, not that I didn't love J Hope or RMs. Um, but Sugar, this that was such a hard flow. And then there's that little piano part in there with Choppa and actually played a little piano. Um, then in like his diction's in 4K, like talking. Um, J Hope, as usual, he comes in with that first like unusual flow, but then it's just like a whole entire groove and you you just feel it like he said with the body um an rm his was really good um it was angry though and i'm not used to hearing that from rm um that kind of anger from him um i know why it's there it's completely warranted but usually to me at least i know him as the more level-headed kim down to you know he's just all right here's what i think and like these all these blah layer and there's there's still layers, but it's anger and um different to see for me, at least from RM. Or Ratmon, Rat Monster, he was back then. Uh this is so Cypher Part Two. Um I know I believe part one and part two. Sorry if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure part two um is about the B free thing. Um how he was like being super rude to him. Like yeah, y'all know. that was cool that was super cool i've i haven't heard something like that before um they hope he has infinite flows um the guy can just to any any beat he can just get a flow to it and it's like dancing um as many of you have said it's it's like his rap comes from his dancing past where it's just he's just like dancing around the beat and his voices as well and he kind of gets you to feel that way like you can't help but kind of just bop to it um i've noticed that when i listen to jack in the box in the car with my wife and my kids i'll have on like safety zone and i'll and i'll see their head bopping a little bit i'm like yep i mean they they do like it but it's you literally cannot help but go like this when they're singing i mean that they're that good I'm I'm loving part two. Like we're 40 seconds in and I'm loving it. So cool. <laughs> like another song I'm here for it I'm, I'm here <laughs> 
Now red white for what a cycle. Nigga dice on a mini mana dice dice. Cycle, nigga nice mini mana nice so nigga pride the mini mana Christ slow. Then I'm priceless. You do the more than a rebel need to the shit you on little chumps of the mega rebel. You can want peace now. He's young, don't get that kid. Your mama did not make your fuck. He he ha di di bang bang. She's a big naga. Joy cha cha my joy cha pie ba. I got to go suck that up a tombstone. Nah 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 go. Try the whole bitch being being pow pow. No no no. Cha 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 di ne. I pa she she ga ga. We have each other in mogul chair on the porch. PC bang maga. What the? <laughs> okay. Um, it's like a, like I said, a completely different song. Um, I, did, I don't even know what to say about what RM just did. <laughs> wow. This is one of the things where you can read it four or five times, go over it, and you're going to get a different meaning every time. Um, I'm going to go back quite a bit here. More than a rebel, need to that shit, young little chumps of the man, young rebel. You can want peace, now he's young, don't get that kid, you're my body, don't make your fucking he, he, ha, ha, dee, dee, bang, bang, she's a topic, nah, nah, joy, cha, cha, my joy, cha, bye, bye, sang, I go, suck, that's up a tombstone, nah, 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 go, try the whole bitch, bing, bing, pow, pow, no, 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 cha, 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 dee, nah, ah, ba, she, she, ga, ga, grab, each other, they mogul, chair, on them boys, PC, bang, my god, you can go, and a king, on a dumb, jack, sheep, boss, time, turn a bubble gum, do the numb, me, now the numb, me, a ton of numb, kick it now, bitch, be putting up a numb, and go, let you know, you my nigga, fool, and that, oh, Flying. Oh my god. Uh, just the way he plays with words and um you know I don't know how accurate exactly this is because I know sometimes you have to take liberties with translating, um, especially when it's this fast and the flow is going. Um wow. Ugh. Like breathless man trying to keep up with this. Okay, we're gonna go back to the liberal translation there. Sorry, don't bother. Literal translation you, you be a fabric because you have no thread. I like that lyric. I parachute on my Neverland. I'm a Peter Pan. So this will never end. He never ages. His his lyrics, his raps are so good that they're gonna transcend time. <laughs> oh. All right. Man, when he gets mad, look out, man. Um it's like um the old 90s or early 2000s battle rapping, you know. Crazy. I'm the king, I'm the god, so when my empire said, I perish on my Neverland. I'm a Peter Pan, so from never end, you know, when I ride on my G5, it's your first class, and said it's fine, I kept giggling, kept giggling, kept giggling, put your fucking my bitch, I'm boot trouble, I'm a shin guard, I'm a shin yum, put a shin pyong, all these hoes of the dealer, I didn't even have a leg, nigga never let, duck, 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 he be tricky, how about that, my fuck, 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 she's the baby, now I'm trying to go to the door, need a rebel, I can't have it, fuck, fuck, fuck. What is this? <laughs> wow. I just... The next batter, sugar. First stop. Um... You know, I would just say this. I want to say this real quick. I, the production and the thought that they put into their music, I don't know if it's just a constant in K-pop. Um, I know a lot of groups aren't that way, but I it seems like like just production and everything that they do, it's so well thought out. Um, I don't know if it's just BTS, because all I listen to is BTS um, for K-pop. Um, but it's amazing. I can't think of a lot of artists that do that. Um, you know, I've been reacting to Taylor Swift, and I know she does a lot of callbacks to her older work, and you really got to understand her background to know what she's talking about. But, yeah. 
Nuts. It's only part two. <laughs> wow. He said he may be underground, but like you're dead. We're above ground. We're alive because you sleep all night. We... He's like. I like how he turned that on. They're like, well, we're underground. We're better than you because you're popular. It's like, no, you're underground because you're dead. We're alive, at least. At least people are hearing our music. Who messes with these guys, man? Why? I love it. Wow. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I feel like he's yelling at me for a second there. Sugar. Stop, man. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I did need to break for stop for a second. I'm trying to keep up with this and like think of what he's talking. Sorry, I was blocking my mouth. And think of what he's talking about um with the person. Um, I don't want to say his name too much, but who goes at these guys? It's like going at um another rapper that we all know. You, you just don't don't go at him. Don't go at Sugar. Don't go at RM. Believe me. My God. All right. I'm going to try to remember all the disses that Sugar just said. Um, <clears throat> He just said that your label is going to give up on you because you suck. You don't work hard enough. I work harder. More people hear my stuff because you're underground and I'm above ground. Um, when your girl hears my voice, she loves me. Just <clears throat> in a verse. You know? Um, that one was really, really good. Um, J-Hope was kind of... He did the beginning and he kind of did like the middle parts, it seemed like. Um, I really liked his part, but RM's verse in that was amazing. Oh my god. Um, it was, it blew me away. Like, I've, yeah, I don't, I've seriously never heard anything like that before. Um, and then Sugar comes in and blows me away again, you know. Um, he's coming in so fast and so angry like that. Um, the way he can tone his voice, it's like he's literally jumping through the mic at you and he's right in your ear. Um, I don't know how they tune it or what, but. Okay, I, I'm pu I pulled up three. Uh, I hope I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go to bed after this, man. Yeah. 
one lyric was weird. What beef is So is this an answer to the interview I saw in Rise of Bang Tan or I believe when RM went on and talked to those guys? I don't remember. Hmm. But it seems like though. <laughs> Okay, this is like a, a completely different style of rap. Um, the first two were like these really hard, kind of old school raps, and this is more, I don't want to say trap, but it's definitely different. Um, I like it, but RM's come in with like a completely different style and sounding amazing. <laughs> So it is trap. Oh, okay. I like trap. Like I said, his flaw, man. What, what was that? Never heard that before. Turn on. Shugga. Whoa. Okay. I mean, I, I'm not going to deny. I mean, I've never, um, you know, I've been listening to him, but, you know, 
maybe one day, I guess. That'd be weird out of nowhere. By the way, I know it's metaphorical, but maybe not. Is there any style they cannot do? Trap. Um, like I said, I I like trap. I don't mind it. Um, I'm a huge Juice World fan. I listen to Juice World all the time, almost every day. Um, it was interesting. I think in that one, um, when I listen to it, I'm really gonna hone in on Jay Hope's verse. Um, I really like the sound of his voice in that, in this like kind of that weird flow he did. Um. That was definitely like a more um upbeat one. I wouldn't say not as angry, but they're just like tell the first two are really angry ones, and this one's kind of like, eh, you know? F off. <laughs> that was the whole vibe of that song. Um, and I was there for it. That that song was fun. Um, so I got four pulled up here. Let's go. Who's first? Ooh. I like the beat. I'm liking this a lot. So this is the RM I know more. Um, more just kind of chilled out like, hey, you know, sorry I'm everywhere. Sorry, um, my addiction's not good enough. Uh, but I mean, I'm here on top. So, sorry. <laughs> I'm going to go back because I want to hear that everything, everything, everything again. That last part was good. That was good. Like, yeah, whatever, man. I love myself. Yep. All of jump time. Straight to the most fun spotlight. Oh, you wanna be my life? Wanna be, wanna be. Come to the end of the day, it's a wild bash. No, hey. Get up, get up. 
Eyes on that break, why high five? Look to go by on the yacht, man. You they go do it all that show me, yeah, man. J Ho, my God, it's like he's coming in with burn after burn after burn, and he's just like, I'm gonna keep going, I'm gonna keep climbing, I'm gonna keep working, and you're gonna keep being in where you are. No matter how hard you work, you're gonna scream from your position, and I'm gonna keep being up on that ladder. I love, I love that positiveness that like I'm working hard no matter what and that's where I am where I am <clears throat> I'm here because all I do is work I have talent and all I do is put it to use you're just complaining like you don't even have talent and you're out there complaining about people that have it so sit down man love it Mm-hmm. And he quits talking. are amazing um it's really interesting to see the evolution of the ciphers over time um knowing the evolution of bts over time how they came out like you know these happy young guys and they just got crapped on <laughs> everywhere by everybody their own peers in the industry just horrible crap they went through and the first two songs show that, like, their anger at it and their just reaction to it. And, like, you know, you talk about me, I'm going to punch back. I'm going to hit you back even harder than you hit me. Um, because it's what they needed at the time. Um, and I think it was appropriate, um, whether, you know, you think that or not. If you should punch back harder, you know, I, I don't know. Um, but it wasn't physical. It was in rap. Um, you know, I'm talking about just rap. Um, you know, these people are saying these things about them, writing articles, getting them on their shows, and then talking down to them, just not even being respectful on a basic human level to them. So they go hard in a song and just annihilate them. Um, I would assume probably mess up their careers a little bit because that was amazing. Um, Cypher Part 2 especially. Oh, 2 was amazing. I'm going to listen to 2 right when I'm done with this and just soak that bad boy in. I'm going to sit and just close my eyes and just let it wash over me. Um, that's one of my favorite things to do is I actually sit here and put my headphones on and just let the music wash over me. Um, people are probably like, that's weird, dude. 
Yeah, I'm a little weird. <laughs> um, but um, yeah, and then three and four, they were more um, reflective. Like, you know, you may not like me, but I like me. I have an audience. I have army. I have a career. You don't. So like, you can say what you want, but it's not really affecting me. Um, so I guess I wish you the best. Maybe quit screaming from the shadows because it's not doing you any favors. Um, and then four is like, hey, I love myself. Um, you should just probably stop. Um, I don't hate you anymore. I feel, you know, nothing towards you. And um, while I'm climbing to the top, I won't even think about you. Well, you are constantly thinking about me, leaving hate comments, uh, which actually helped me. Uh, they help my post, <laughs> like RM said, you know. I would rather have a hate comment than no comment because YouTube, I, you know, okay, I, I don't know if you know this as a viewer. When you leave a rude comment, YouTube doesn't know that it's rude. I mean, they will if you swear or you put certain words in it, but it just sees it as a comment and that's a good thing. I mean, it's not good to read for me or whoever you're leaving it for. It kind of sucks, but YouTube still sees it as a comment and then that's a good thing and pushes a video to more people. Same thing with a dislike. You hit dislike and leave a bad comment. You're actually helping that video. So like you're hating on them, but you're actually helping them. So if you actually hate it, just quit watching it. And don't even hit dislike. Don't even comment. Just go back to your page. Say, don't recommend this. Boom. That's the best thing you can do if you don't like something. Because that's how the algorithm works. Uh, it doesn't care if you leave a bad comment. Um, same with instagram and twitter and everywhere else it's some people will literally post things to get anger comments because it doesn't matter it helps um i personally would never do that because i don't like crappy comments um they're not fun i don't like reading them um i'm used to it now i don't you know it is what it is but um that's where he's going with that it's like you know you're wasting your time i don't care um so yeah that was really fun um i really liked four too one and three were good. Um, three was more of the trap one, and I really like trap. Uh, but sometimes trap, you have to kind of hear a couple times to get the song grooving, at least for me. Um, kind of like Juice World, I had to hear a couple of his songs like three or four times before it really stuck with me. And now they're like some of my favorites. Um, but yeah, I really like to. Um, yeah, thank you all for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please hit like, please hit subscribe. That really does help out. Please share this video as well. That helps out more than you know. Until next time, take care of yourself. Take care of others. Take it easy.